Did you know that astronauts age slower than people on Earth? Or that the top of your head is literally older than your feet? Or what if I told you that the now you think you're living in doesn't even exist? We think we understand the concept of time. Seconds tick into minutes, minutes into hours, hours into days, and life marches on. But beneath that clock face lies a reality so bizarre, so utterly twisted, that even Einstein admitted. The distinction between past, present, and future is only a stubbornly persistent illusion. Welcome to World Decoded, where today we dive into the weird world of time, where clocks lie, memories bend, and the universe doesn't care about your calendar. So buckle up, because what you're about to hear will change how you see time, forever. Time is not a steady drumbeat echoing across the universe. It's a slippery, bendable force that changes depending on where you are and how fast you're moving. Sounds like science fiction, but it's real. Thanks to Einstein's theory of relativity, we know that time moves slower the faster you go or the closer you are to a gravitational source. Here's the wild part. Astronauts aboard the International Space Station experience time slightly more slowly than people on Earth. That's because their high speed slows time down, more than the weaker gravity speeds it up. So over six months in space, they age about 0.005 seconds less than we do. In a way, they're time travelers, just not the flashy, sci-fi kind. Even more bizarre, time moves faster at the top of a mountain than at sea level, and your head is aging faster than your feet, every second of every day, and it's measurable. Gravity stretches time just like it curves space. So the next time you lie down flat, remember, you're sinking your body's clock. Here's where we go full sci-fi, but backed by physics. Some quantum theories suggest that time as we know it doesn't actually exist. Instead of a flowing river, time may be a stack of static moments, like frames in a film reel. Your consciousness simply flips through them one by one. In this theory, the past, present, and future all exist simultaneously. Your birth, your first heartbreak, your final breath, they're all sitting in space-time right now. You're just not there yet, or maybe you are. It all depends on how you look at it. Some physicists believe that what we call change is just the illusion of movement between these frames. Reality is already written. You're just living one page at a time. It sounds poetic, but it's also deeply unsettling. If time doesn't flow, do we even have free will? Or are we just passengers in a universe that's already happened? Here's a concept that'll rattle your sense of reality. You are never living in the present, ever. Everything you see, hear, and touch is processed with a delay. Your brain is always playing catch up. In fact, scientists estimate we experience the world with a delay of around 80 milliseconds. To keep things smooth, your brain does something remarkable. It predicts the immediate future and presents that forecast as now. So when you think you're reacting in real time, you're actually responding to a mental hallucination of what your brain expects to happen. Reality, as you perceive it, is a lagging simulation. We live in the past, disguised as the present. Let that sink in. The now doesn't really exist, and you're always one step behind. Let's talk about one of the most tantalizing ideas of all, time travel. It's not just a Hollywood fantasy. In some ways, it's already happening. Astronauts and satellites experience time at a different rate than us due to gravity and speed. Which means that time ticks slower for astronauts on the ISS. That's basic relativity in action. But what about going backwards? That's where things get complicated. Theoretical models like wormholes or closed time like curves suggest that it might be possible to loop back to the past. But they come with huge paradoxes. If you travel back in time and stop your grandparents from meeting, do you erase yourself? To solve this, some physicists propose the many worlds theory, the idea that every decision spawns a new universe. So if you went back and changed the past, you wouldn't be changing your timeline. You'd be creating a new, alternate one. Time travel wouldn't rewrite history, it would branch it. It's not just trippy, it's plausible. And it means that somewhere out there, another you might already be exploring a different future. Most of us think there's a global clock ticking away, some universal now that sinks us all. But according to relativity, that idea is an illusion. Depending on your position in space and how fast you're moving, your now might be someone else's past or future. There is no single universal present. The now is personal, local, and constantly shifting. 
If you were speeding through the galaxy near light speed, you could watch events on Earth unfold in an entirely different sequence than someone standing still. So, two people looking at the same event from different reference frames might not agree on when it happened. This isn't just theoretical. GPS satellites orbiting Earth have to constantly correct for time dilation caused by both their speed and altitude, or else your Google Maps would be wildly inaccurate. Your phone literally depends on relativity to tell you where the nearest pizza place is. Have you ever walked into a room you've never been in and felt like you've already been there? That eerie moment is called deja vu, and it might just be your brain's weirdest trick with time. Most scientists believe it's a timing error in the brain. Your mind accidentally stores a current experience as a memory before fully processing it. So by the time you're aware of it, your brain thinks it's remembering something instead of living it. But here's the twist. Some researchers say deja vu could be your brain predicting the future and confusing it with the present. Like your mind is constantly simulating what's about to happen, and occasionally, it gets it eerily right. And the wildest theory? Deja vu might be a glitch between parallel realities. For a split second, you could be tapping into a version of yourself in another timeline, living almost the same life, but just slightly ahead. It's a simple moment, but it questions everything we know about memory, perception, and time itself. Let's take time to its weirdest level, the quantum world. Here, the rules get seriously trippy. If you could somehow travel at the speed of light, time would stop completely for you. You could reach the Andromeda galaxy without aging a second, at least in theory. In practice, you'd be crushed into atomic soup long before liftoff. Still, the idea stands that if we move fast enough, time vanishes. Now zoom in even deeper. Some physicists believe time doesn't flow smoothly at all. Instead, it ticks in tiny bursts called chronons, flashing in and out of existence 10 to the power of 43 times per second. Imagine the universe as a cosmic flipbook, moment by moment with tiny gaps of nothingness in between. And here's the real kicker. Thanks to the quantum Zeno effect, which says that just watching a particle can literally freeze it in time. Observation changes outcome, and time itself responds to being seen. So while you've been watching this video, time didn't just pass. It warped, stretched, and might have flickered in quantum beats, all while you aged faster at your head than your feet. If this video broke your brain in the best way possible, Hit that like button and subscribe to World Decoded for more reality-shifting explorations like this one. Drop a comment with your favorite concept about, or just let us know which part freaked you out the most. Because here, we don't just tell stories. We decode the world.